twice, I showed you how to mint an NFT for free in this video and this video, and there have been countless comments asking me whether or not it's possible to do it on your phone, and the answer is yes. You can mint a free NFT on your phone with no money, gasless, zero. So let's get into it. I'm gonna show you how to do it. I'm gonna show you two ways. The first way is an alternative site called Mintable, so we're gonna use that, and the second way is an open sea. So hang around if you wanna learn both ways on how to mint an NFT for free. Let's get the show on the road. Roll the intro. As you can see, brand new wallet. I created a brand new wallet for this, zero Ethereum, there's nothing on it. So what we're gonna do is click on the upper left corner on the three little lines right there and then choose browser. I'm gonna go to the browser, obviously DuckDuckGo, don't use Google, man, Google sucks. So I'm gonna use DuckDuckGo, I'm gonna type in Mintable. All right, we're gonna go to the first one, mintable.app. So you also need to make a Mintable account, and that's pretty straightforward, it's just like creating a Facebook or Instagram account, so nothing hard about that one, we're gonna click to on Mint. Alright, the NFT is not in my wallet, we're gonna create a new listing, so you can either go with Immutable X, or you can go with Ethereum Mainnet Gasless, so you have Traditional and you have Gasless. We're gonna go on Gasless, and the guys over at Mintable did this, they created some sort of algorithm, I, I don't know man, I don't know the technical details about how this works, but you do have 50 free NFTs on the Ethereum mainnet, so we're gonna proceed to Mint, uh, as for the listing title, I'm gonna go with Test, as for the subtitle, I'm gonna go with Test one, uh, very creative, I know. <laughs> Let's add the files, I'm gonna take a photo right now, uh, and I'm gonna take a photo of you guys. Here we go, this, this is you, right here. All right, I'm gonna mint this as an NFT, let's use this photo. And here you can click on attach private file or unlockable content, so that's very useful. For example, if you want to mint an audio NFT, you can mint a picture, and then if someone buys the picture, they can unlock the audio or the song. So when you do that, you, you will just upload your private file right here, but since we're not gonna do it this time. I'm not gonna use the private file or unlockable content, but it could be very useful for a lot of things. Really, your creativity is the only thing preventing you from making something incredible. So, as for the description, we're gonna go with test again. I'm gonna transfer the copyright when it's purchased uh, because I don't really care, you can do that, you don't have to, it's really up to you how you want to do that, so as for the price and type, either fixed or auction, I always like to go with a fixed price, but you can always also use an auction, it's pretty self-explanatory, we're gonna sell it for one Ethereum, and let's list this item, I didn't choose this category and subcategory, okay, <laughs> as for the category, we're gonna go with collectibles, and as for the subcategory, I'm gonna use art, because I, I really believe that the picture I took is pure art, and no one can tell me otherwise. All right, let's list this item. You're about to send one transaction to the blockchain. Just sign the message in your wallet to mint and list this item. Proceed. All right, we're gonna sign this absolutely free. Congratulations, your item is listed on sale successfully. And I can view my item right here. There we go, one Ethereum. If anyone wants to buy this from my test account, I have five star rating right here, <laughs> apparently. I can also boost this item. Uh, per the, yeah, you don't have funds. Uh, obviously you need to pay in order to boost. So if you do end up selling anything, you can uh, boost your listing. So if anyone's interested in buying this picture of a camera for one Ethereum, <laughs> I wanna put a link in the description. <laughs> All right guys, that's the first way. That's by using Mintable, everything through my phone, through the MetaMask app. Now I'm gonna show you the second way. The second way is an open C. So let's go over at OpenSea.io, uh, the main website of OpenSea. We're gonna click on create. And before I go on and show you how to mint this, take half a second, guys. Leave a like for the YouTube algorithm. It's always very much appreciated. And while you're at it, if you're new to the channel, click subscribe, click the little bell icon. You never miss out on any future videos. And this, again, is just a straight forward video, I just wanted to give you a quick, short, to the point tutorial of how to mint a free NFT on your mobile phone. So here we are at OpenSea, let's choose a file, let's take another photo of you guys, this is going to be another one Ethereum a mint. Alright, this should be pretty epic, I love this, what do you guys think? I, th I think I've outdone myself with this one. Let's actually give it a proper name this time. I'm gonna call it the camera crew, uh, there's no external link. So, obviously you can use an external link to show people a little bit more about your NFT. So what it says right here, OpenSea will include this URL, this link for the item detail page, so the users can click and learn more about it. I don't have anything 
So I'm not gonna put anything down, but as for the description, we're gonna use this is my camera crew. All right, it is not part of a collection, so we're not gonna use that. Um, then again, you can also use properties, level stats, and that's more for collection type of items. Like when you have 10,000 items in a collection, you could use properties, traits, etc., etc. Uh, I'm not gonna use any of that for this because I, I, I don't have anything to put down here just for the camera crew right here But as for unlockable content, we've already gone over that so we're not gonna use unlockable content But you you guys definitely can as for explicit content uh, <laughs> I would say this picture is pretty fire. It could be it could be 18 plus, you know, but it's not there's no nudity There's no violence. There's there's nothing so I'm not gonna uh, check that either as for quantity I want only one and now the main and most important important thing when you choose the blockchain if you choose ethereum it will ask you for a gas fee if you choose polygon right here it will not ask you for a gas fee so let's click on create please wait and you created camera crew all right let me copy this link it is not on sale yet so it works a little bit different than on mintable it is not on sale yet we still need to sell it but here we go this is the item right here minted on the blockchain and as you can see i already tried minting two before just to see if it really works through my phone and <laughs> lo and behold it does we're gonna go on sell all right i'm gonna sell it for one ethereum once again so we have the same item a uh, similar item not the exact same on mintable and the similar item on open sea we're gonna go to complete listing and fees this is a 2.5 percent service fee and the fee is only calculated once the item gets sold so there's nothing nothing for you to pay we're gonna click on sign sign again and here we go i have listed my nft for sale for completely free and you know it's free because i don't have anything on this wallet it is completely empty zero ethereum zero dollars zero everything all right well here's my item on sale for one ethereum you can see everything listings um price history there's obviously nothing no offers no uh there's a little description this is my camera crew but apart from that it's been minted and it's been listed for free ladies and gentlemen once again i'm gonna go to my wallet i don't have any funds on this wallet as you can see totally empty so works like a charm every time the item can now be sold the buyer pays for the gas fees when buying the item the seller doesn't pay for anything totally free so this was done on an iphone i tried doing it on an android as well and the open c version works like a charm as for mintable i can do it through immutable x but for some reason when i do through traditional ethereum like i showed right here on the iphone example the ios example it didn't want to upload the picture so it's a little bug on mintable right now it has absolutely nothing to do with an android and it should work like a charm maybe by the time you're watching this video it already works like a charm but just as a me recording this video it didn't really work like I expected it to work so that's why I did it through iPhone so guys with that being said thank you so much for watching this video thank you for 40,000 subscribers huge milestone for 50k we're gonna do a huge giveaway don't get it twisted we're doing a lot of things on the 4th of February I'm gonna pull the winners for the San Vegas Casino Club NFT giveaway and other than that thank you for watching once again I'll see you next time peace